all right so i have all the figures um out of the box and let's go through each one and take a closer look at them all right let's start off with the um the group figure that is sold separately from the set um it comes with uh swappable hands it comes with the wings that was not attached initially and then I'm not sure I haven't watched the movie but it has like a baby rocket here so um, it's just interesting to find out what that would be about and so looking at this group figure I, I actually really like this figure here um, it's not too heavy but it looks really good it looks really cool it seems like it's like a muscular version of Groot you know compared to the the tall version of Groot this one's really nice and so the head scan here or mold looks good has some like green leaf effects on him I think this is a really cool Groot figure here the wings nicely done back of the body all of Groot's roots <laughs> Just, yeah this is really cool to be able to pose with you can swap the arms to give it that muscle effect angry look yeah really enjoyed it this figure all right let's look at the next one so um, I'll go through let's look at um, Star Lord first since he doesn't have a build a figure piece um, and I wanted to also bring up that uh, to make sure you get all the accessories and what it should include if you look at the back of the box um, this is not a good example because so the accessories pictured will be included so what he's holding is usually included but on the side of it usually has the additional accessories that he's not holding I'll show you when I have a figure that has that. But um, here's Star Lord, and he comes with his weapon of choice. And I really, like I said, I really like the team they have this time. The face scan's really good, actually. It's it's pretty improved since his previous scans. He have his suit, little badge in the middle, the the blue and red colorway, really nice. Black boots, so not a lot of accessory for a Star Lord, um, but the scan itself is really nice, and no build a figure piece for him. So in case you don't need to, you have. Well, I think it will complete the team to have him, so it's still a must for me, in, in my opinion. So let's go to Adam Warlock. So here's Adam Warlock. Um, so let me see. He also doesn't come with any accessories, so there's no picture of it but he the build a figure piece he should have is pictured here so just double check that you get it as the helmets and the tail and then you get Adam Warlock so looking at him he's got a nice scan he has the little dot on his forehead all gold skin tone red cape uh, plastic like we've seen it does seem like the legs are the same as the Iron Man not too sure but it seems like the same feel I I get from either Iron Man or Vision but um, the details on the cape is pretty good little gold label yeah, Adam Warlock, and it comes with a tail, and the 
shield, the head helmet. Okay, so here's a good piece to look at uh, Nebula. Alright, so like I'm saying, um, what she should include in the package, the accessories are the cannon and the saber. But um, she also includes the stuff she's holding, is what I'm trying to say. So the gun that's not pictured here, she's holding, is also included right here. So that's how you make sure you get everything and then you have Cosmos Lake. So yeah, she comes with her saber, cannon gun, and a little pistol gun. And Cosmos Lakes. So another pretty nice head scan here. I'm not sure if it's, it just looks a lot better, this one. And it does look like her, the actress itself. Comes with the same suit and then the, the arm here, the left arm. That's more metalized or from when um, the, the Avengers Endgame, if I recall. So here it is. So there's no place to put the accessories on her belt. So that's a little bit of a bummer. But the face scan is screwed, in my opinion. Next up, one of my favorite characters. Oops, that one's Nebula Mantis. So we did get Mantis as a builder figure in the previous um, Guardians of the Galaxy set, and now she comes in her own. She only comes with the Cosmo leg, and that's no accessory other than that. But she has her trademark pose, her. You know, psychic abilities, antennas are cool. Not sure if it's the same head scan as the build a figure, but regardless, it looks good. And she has some green highlights on her hair. Does seem like the same body sculpt as Nebula, but could be different. Not too good with identifying the parts but I like Mantis so this is a good figure to have and like I noticed a lot of the new you know build figure sets certain figures don't come with a lot of accessories but you know it might be a cost-cutting issue next up we have Drax Oop. Make sure I get this and he comes with his daggers, two daggers here. And then Cosmo's hands, I believe. Um, and here's Drax. Um played by Batista, of course. Um head scan is good. I I prefer this the yelling version of Drax because that's more accurate of him in the films like when he's in the fight mode or you know when he's going crazy it it's just a better look in my opinion as a figure but this is nice too it does have his uh, futures and I, I like the sculpt on his this one he's like kind of bulkier like his muscles are actually kind of noticeable in this figure and you know he got some of the more oh he has the place to put the daggers on his boots as well so it's kind of like the previous figures he had so that's pretty cool Drax alright next up we have our all time or most of our favorite the very funny um, rocket, you know, it's such a tiny figure. It's like half, like it's like my the size of my hand. It could fit, <laughs> but 
but he he's got you know more serious look here it's an angry look it's just so cute with the you know tiny suit team suit he has his tail comes out from the back and he comes with a cannon that's almost a actually it's, it's not like the same size as him which is pretty hilarious how he can hold that up in the movies and he comes with the bigger piece of build a figure he comes with the actual body of Cosmo which this is a funny set you know he and Groot are the best of buddies and lastly we have Kraglin and he comes with a few things he comes with his arrow with the the, the effect next to him and I think you can have him hold it on his hands and he comes with a little dagger here that can be placed on his holder comes with Cosmo's arms looking at Kraglin the details on his face look good he has the you know the mohawk and then the scratches on his face is very detailed he looks like really good here comes with that little um what do we call this like a waist belt or for his weapons i guess it's, you can put his arrow in it's got some gloves um yep so you have here craglin so pretty cool and so um, let me set them up so we can build a figure all right so let's um, build Cosmo so let's look at Cosmo here and let's start with the helmet so that we get it correctly placed so looks like how do we do this I think like oh I get it sorry so this will well let's clip these in first so hmm, I wonder if I oh wait no so there's these brackets that should go into Cosmo but I think I might have to pop the head off first I'm not sure yep so you pop the head off and then you fit these into the holes here like that well let me see let me... oh there's a bigger side so the bigger the longer area here fits the long side there so just line it up and then push in just like that you gotta hear the click and we can put Cosmo's head back in and so So you do have to align it so that the helmet fits over and just pop it into place carefully of course so that's how it is like that but it just he's still exposed to whatever if, if this is the case I might have put it let me see the picture real quick. Okay, so I think I did it. Oh, let's see. Could be this way because that's how it's sitting. And just, oops, shoot. I just have to be careful and I popped it. Okay. 
so let's pop it back in place there we go now we can have Cosmo nice and secure here I might have done it wrong but let's do that for now and so let's look at detail that Warlock comes with This one's simple, you just pop it in there, just like that, and then let's look at the back leg, so Nebula is the left leg here. Let's see, make sure. It goes in there we go and then mantis is the other side I have the card here so that's what I'm reading it from for which build a figure piece goes to which there we go and then so number six is Craglin. It goes to the left side here. These don't pop as well as the head did. There you go. And lastly, we got Drax on the left hand side. There we go, that fit. And there you have it, build a figure Cosmo. Super cute. Really like the dog suit he has, the tail. Really nice. Let me just see if we can pop him up. There it is. Much easier to set up with the dog being on all fours but there you have it so the Hasbro Guardian of the Galaxy Volume 3 build a figure Cosmo set along with Groot in the back so if you enjoyed this video please like and subscribe